Well, we're doing a lot of sawing right now and trying to get all the plywood platforms, which are the bases of the cat tunnels, and all the two by twos, which are the runners underneath them that kind of give them the rigidity. Trying to get those all cut so that when Mindy gets here tonight, uh, we can start painting. So she's coming down to help do a lot of the painting, but I have to get all the wood cut first. So it's quite a project here. So we've got basically, hopefully you can see all that. That's uh, most of the plywood that's cut. They're four feet long by one foot wide. Um, here's some more stacked right here. Kind of using that as a little bit of an outfeed table right now. Ton of two by fours. Um, I got 28 foot two by fours. And there's some more over here that I've already cut into uh, two by twos. And then I decided that cutting the full eight foot length by ripping those into two individual two by twos uh, is just too difficult. They're not too long. So I'm cutting these off with the circular saw into six foot lengths. And um, it's a little easier to rip the six foot length than it is the eight foot length. And I really don't think I need any longer than six feet anyway, at least not for the cat tunnels. For the enclosure, I will. But right now, uh, this is what's going on. We've got a lot of sawing going on. And um, Mindy is on her way down here. And hopefully we'll get a lot of painting done this weekend and uh, be that much closer to getting Lucky's cat -a tat all put together. So Mindy's here and we just finished painting 32 plywood sections. They're each uh, four feet long by one foot wide. They're the basis for the cat tunnels. So we have two drying over there and about eight drying along these tables, which are really my table saw and some saw horses covered with a tarp. And then there were 22 stacked on this drying rack that I made a couple days ago, which is just two by fours uh, vertically and then some, you can see on the top, then some uh, three quarter inch plywood across it with holes in it and some PVC pipe sticking through. And so that lets us uh, stack all these pieces of wood to let the paint dry because we wouldn't have room to lay them out anywhere else because I have a little garage. So that's it. This was a very productive night. Tomorrow we'll flip them over and paint the other side and then we'll paint the two by twos after that. So. Say hi, Mindy. Hi, glad I could finally be part of this. It's the best. Okay, that's it for now. Bye. Well, Mindy and I just finished 128 feet of two by twos and plywood that we painted for the bases for Lucky's Cat Tunnel. So we got a lot done this weekend. I appreciate Mindy coming down and helping out. I mean, it is her cat. So I'm glad she came down to help. It really was fun and we got a lot done. I'm glad I didn't have to do it all myself. So more to come. Subscribe to our channel. Thanks, bye.